students welcome back to our it section class how was your exam did you attend all the questions okay fine students did you watch the previous parts of data analysis okay in this chapter we learned a new software libreoffice calc manju and joni decided to undertake a project on the use of electricity and the actions that are needed to control them accordingly they decided to collect three electricity bills each from their friends houses how can the collected bills be tabulated it will be difficult to draw or write them down in a book if it is especially a lengthy list right but LibreOffice Calc, a spreadsheet software in the system, makes it easier. Here I already prepared a mark list. Column A has the names of the children, and the subsequent columns B, C, and D show their respective bill amounts for three different months. Which row records the bills of John's house? Five. Which column records the bills for July? Yes, column D. The electricity bill of Sharath in the month of May has been recorded in a particular cell. What is the cell address? Yes, B6. What is recorded in the cell marked B7? the electricity bill of hasina in the month of may did you understand our next step is find the average electricity expense of a household it is essential to have the sum of all its bills for that select the appropriate cell where the sum of first row is to appear Click on the tool for the sum. This is the tool of sum. Then press Enter key from the keyboard. Look, first row's sum is ready. Next, we need to find the sum of other rows. For that, click here and drag it down. Don't forget to select only the cell. that contain the sum students did you understand okay in the next class we will learn how to find average today's class is over thank you